guys, today I'm going to be doing a response to attack by Bakemon13 and he asked what do you focus uh, your collection on? Well the simple answer to that is I don't really focus on anything in particular. Now I know some people will say like oh I want a complete Mega Drive collection or some, what, something like that or I want to collect an entire series of games or something but I'm not really like that. I just go to like the store and if I see a game that I think I like I pick it up but I don't do it with any specific targets in mind because at the moment I can't really afford to be like getting these huge targets because I can't like afford an entire collection of like Mega Drive games or whatever um, um, that might be something I'd look into when I'm older, well, when I've got a job or whatever, but at the moment I can't afford to do that. And anyway, that would probably uh, mean getting some pretty bad games if I was going to try and go for an entire collection. So, uh, I don't know why I'd really want to get games that I knew were bad. And I'm not really that much of a collector, so I wouldn't really get them much satisfaction from just owning them so yeah um, having said that there are certain systems I buy more games for than others for instance uh, Sega Mega Drive games tend to be a lot cheaper than like Xbox 360 or Wii games so I tend to get more uh, Mega Drive games because like, they're obviously easier to afford but sometimes you might be able to get like eight Mega Drive games for the price of a Wii game or something like that so yeah and also I f figured I'd kill two birds with one stone and I'm gonna do just gonna show a few pickups I picked up recently I thought it'd fit in it's only three games um, first one is Wipeout 2097 for the PlayStation uh, this is the Platinum Edition, don't really bother me, but yeah, um, it's a nice arcade style racing game. Uh, graphically it's a bit dated, but it's still fun. Next is an awesome game, this is Fantasy Star Online, which is an RPG for the Dreamcast. Um, obviously the online servers have gone down now, so you can't play the online part, but the offline part's still awesome. Uh, beaten the first six quests I think and I really want to play more of this game it's a lot of fun and I think there are ways you can get uh, the online features via like third party servers or whatever so I might look into that later and also for the Mega Drive Thunder Force 4 uh, this is a shoot em up um, it's quite a fun game but I wasn't very good at it and just was a bit hard so I might look and see if I can get better at it. So it looks like a nice game, quite good graphically but as I said I've been failing at it so <laughs> yeah okay so hope you enjoyed watching this video um, I'll put up another video soon bye